What's going on, guys? Welcome to another episode of Seriously Fast Diecast here at Seriously Fast Media. We're going to be going over my newest arrival, kind of one that's unexpected. Today, I ended up getting this car um, very unexpected. I was going to purchase it through CSO Diecast, but I pre-ordered it, and I completely forgot that I even ordered this car. Uh, ended up getting it today, and my daughter and my stepson got all excited, sent a video chat with me, and uh, wanted to open it before I got home, which I could not, obviously I wasn't going to let them do that, uh, but definitely a very nice car. It was one of the races that I attended last year, so it was a must-have for my collection, so make sure you guys check it out. Make sure you guys hit the thumbs up, hit that bell icon, subscribe, and we are going to keep uh, doing some of this Seriously Fast diecast stuff. You guys seem to like it, so keep it shared. Let me know if you guys have gotten one of these or if you got one ordered. Make sure you leave that in the comment section below. Thanks for watching, guys. All right, so here we are. We do have, uh, this actually is a car that surprised me. I was not expecting to get this one uh, today, but I did get a little video chat from my daughter and my stepson. Super excited, wanted to pop this open. And well, here it is. So big hint on what I've got. I've got my parking pass from uh, this race. $10 to park at Nashville. A little ridiculous, but hey, whatever. I've never paid to park anywhere else, ever. So there's always that. So here it is, 2021 Kyle Busch Nashville Raced Win. This is the first race. This was the first race I went to in 2021. Uh, first race I attended. So let's get it popped open. So as you can kind of see here, hopefully, there we go. Kyle Busch, M&M's Nashville win. Uh, one out of 2100. So this is a very well produced car here. So, Kyle Busch, inaugural Tennessee Lottery 250 winner, Nashville, Tennessee, June 19th, 2021. Time of race, 2 hours, 20 minutes, 48 seconds. He started on the pole. There were 189 laps run, including 8 cautions for 46 laps. He led 122 out of 189 laps, and he won by 1.11 seconds. I mean, let's be honest, it is Kyle Busch. You definitely expect him to go out and, if not dominate, at least be very, very competitive. All right, so let's get to looking, shall we? So just from popping it open, just from what you can see here, good looking race car. You can see a little bit of the dirt. There's actually a chip right here. So as soon as I get it out from the box, you see the chip right there. Obviously, something can be done with that with a Sharpie very, very simply. But of course, not a good look when you get something and pop it open as the first thing you notice. So going around it, lots of the raced dirt. Bit of an imperfection there on the hood. Pretty blatantly see that. Kind of come to expect that with a lot of these cars. Very unfortunate. You do pay a lot of money for these things. But uh, go around here. Another chip up here. And this is car number 223 out of 2100. The Rowdy Kyle Busch Nashville Xfinity raced win. So, you know, in terms of presentation of the race car, definitely a really good looking car. Plenty of the dirt, a little bit of the rash here on the wheel. 
a little bit of what looks like a, a scuff here, so they did a good job with that. Uh, I can't really tell, it looks like it's another rubbed wheel, but uh, definitely not to the extent of the driver's side wheel, but a good looking race car in terms of quality. Um, not a big fan of that because that is chipped pretty heavily. Now that I get a little closer to it, that's uh, chipped very heavily actually and the hood is not firm or flush. And then of course, like I said, I've got the two chips up on the roof rails. Uh, in terms of presentation, I definitely give this a, a 10 out of 10. In terms of quality, I, I'm gonna have to go a, a seven out of 10 just because the chips in the packaging, you guys saw me, that was the first time I pulled this thing out of the packaging. And then the, the chips here. I mean, that's that's a pretty substantial chip. I'm not a big fan of that damage, but uh, you may send it in, try and get it exchanged. I'm not 100% sure yet. But anyways, so thanks you guys for watching. Quick little video, quick little introduction to the 2021 Nashville Xfinity Series Kyle Busch victory. Thanks for watching guys and make sure you subscribe.